Look at this. We're gonna need a bigger boat. Oh wow, it's actually got. This is the Jaws boat. This is. The, I thought it just looked like the Jaws boat. No, this is intentional. What's up, Survivor fanatics? This is KJ48, and welcome back to my Let's Play for Hold Your Own. All right, guys. Last video, we rescued the trader. Um, we got to go to Trader Island. We did some wheeling and dealing. I think we made some good deals. I actually ate one of the meat stew just to get that because uh, it's gonna go bad right as a matter of fact i'm gonna eat the other one right now i know i wasted some food there but it's not really about the food it's about the wellness all right so we came back home and we got we had a little uh flag we could put up i went ahead and put the flag up right there it was a waste of time because i'm so close to the other flag that putting this up was a waste of time it's not like a ship or anything it's basically just a way i could use the ferry okay also the ferry cost 25 gold but it's a round trip guys so when i when i came home it was uh it was free so that was really really nice all right, so let's take a look at what we got next on our quest line. We have to craft a shipyard in the saw bench, all right? So we need to make a saw bench, okay? And what we're going to need for the saw bench, we have we have everything except for the iron ingots. And I've also been told that once you once you re, uh, like rescue the trader and you go out about your business out into the world, there will be uh, hunters now out here. So... As we're out here looking for iron, we have to be very careful, and I'm going to take you with me, and uh, we'll see how true that is. We'll see uh, if we run into any hunters or not, because um, I'm going to be very, very nervous running into hunters. Yeah, so people are telling me, like, man, I rescued the trader, and all of a sudden, there's freaking hunters everywhere. So that is going to be very, very scary. Uh, I don't know if you guys remember last video, but I told you that back in the day, um, the hunters were everywhere from day one, right? You'd be going out and there'd be hunters everywhere. And I thought it was really weird that there was no hunters everywhere anymore. But apparently um, that you just have to rescue the trader and then the hunters not have to. I mean, it's, it's make it sound like it's something I look forward to. I absolutely do not look forward to dealing with these hunters. But, you know, they're going to be good for money because I'm assuming they're going to drop some gun parts, which would be nice. Uh, oh, we sold all our arrows, didn't we? All right, that was a... Yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to want to fight the hunters with arrows for sure. So why don't we go ahead and grab some stone and some uh, some wood and let's make some arrows. But as we kill hunters, we will get gun parts. And, um, you know, we'll be selling those. So maybe we'll be able to make some money off the, uh, off the hunter problem. So I'm going to look for a big tree too. I don't like hitting these little trees. There's a big one over there. It's kind of out of the way though. Um, yeah, if I come across a hunter when I'm not ready, that's going to suck. If I come across them without any arrows. But I don't want to hit these little trees. Or these like medium trees. Because it, you're just wasting time. You know you're wasting arrows. Or, or axe swings. On the uh, on the, these medium trees. You want to find one of those big ass trees. Because you get two wood per swing. And there's, there's one right there. So that is just wonderful. Let's keep a lookout. Keep our eyes peeled. I'm going to be on edge now. But you know what. If you're not on edge. Then the developer is doing something wrong. Because you should always be on edge. You should always be worried. Um, A, B, W. Always be worried. <laughs> Alright, so while I'm chopping this down, I will get the arrows started. There we go. That's 30 arrows right off the bat. Although it's going to be two and a half minutes before I can make any, or before I'll actually get any. So let's make two at a time. Just so we can get some quicker. Two, and then we'll start doing four. I would like to just get some arrows in my inventory sooner rather than later. And that's good. Okay, let's finish chopping down this tree. Should be a good amount of arrows coming in now. Um, we should also make a fishing a fishing pole. I've never made one yet. Um, there we go. All right, how many do we have? We've got four. It's a good start. Give me a sec, guys. Let me adjust my mic. Let me sit up. Because if we're going to get into some combat, I got to be in the zone. Know what I'm saying? All right. Um, there's another tree there. We should probably harvest this while we're here. Not really what I want to be doing right now, but, you know, it's got to be done. So, I think we have seven iron, so we're going to need another, um... Ooh, I don't like that 13 number. Um, so we're going to go with 14. 14. So we're going to need... Yeah, we're going to need a good amount of iron. We're going to need a good amount of iron. There we go. Okay. Oh, here we go. Alright, good. We're finding some iron. We're also getting some, some arrows. We've actually got some arrows. I feel a little bit... A little bit better. A little bit better. It's also nice that when you uh, when one of your tools gets all used up and breaks, you can actually sell it, which is uh, very, very nice. Very, very nice. I thought they might have taken that out. Back in the day, the tools sold for like 10 gold each, which was like a lot. And then they uh, they nerfed it a little bit, which, you know, is understandable. 
10 gold was a bit much for a tool that was broken. I mean, we can't repair it. I don't know. Maybe, maybe, um, maybe the traders can repair the tools and then they resell them to other people. I don't know how that works. Uh, there's gotta be more people in this area though, like buying and selling from the traders. If, um, you know, it wouldn't just, they wouldn't just be making money off me. So there must be other people buying and selling from them, you know? Now, in the game, is that true? No. No, I don't think so. But, you know, it's kind of just um, putting two and two together and using some some uh, some reasoning. We will probably go to a new island after today. It depends. I'm not really sure. Um, I really want to get that boat made ASAP. Uh, so maybe we won't go to a new island. I'm not really sure. But uh, I do want to go to a new um, island, like, soon. Um, there's, uh, by the oh, actually, is there a new island? Now that I think about it, there might not be any new islands. I saw Trader Island, and I saw Dead Island 1, 2, and 3. Now, Dead Island 1, P, P1, P2, and P3, those are basically like the piers. There's, um, there's, let's take a look. Yeah, there's, there's three piers on this island. Now that I think about it, I don't remember seeing any other island. We might not have access to any other island right now. It's a pig. It's a big freaking pig. He looks big from here. But, all right, let's see if we can find some more iron. I just heard something. I just heard something. It was a human voice, too. I know I heard something. It was like a... Like someone talking. Damn it, where'd it come from? There he is. See? You guys thought I was making it up. Okay. Whoop. Get this sucker. Whoa, deck over his head. Is there no arrow drop or? I'll kill you. Damn it. Oh, freaking. Oh, it was a freaking pig. I thought it was a bear. Don't cross me. Damn, dude. You gonna stop? Got him. Now, is he gonna follow me for the whole way? Probably will. Where is he? Where is he? Oh, I don't like this. Where the hell did he go? Oh, this is... Mm. This is tense. This is tense. The arrows are... The, the bows are really a pain in the ass. Because the other game I play, missed. The bow pulls to the left. Um, the, the, game, the other game I play, other than that, uh, uh, Green Hell. The bow pulls to, pulls to the left. And in this game, the, the arrows go straight. So I'm completely like discombobulated with these arrows. All right, he might be close, but hopefully he went back to where he was. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm in a bad spot here. I, don't, I have no clue where he is. He's probably going to spot me before I spot him. There he is. Oh, boy. Don't shoot me. Don't shoot me. Let's be friends. Oh, God, there's two of them. Not good. Wait, is there two of them? Or is... Yeah, there's two of them. No, don't kill me! Jeebus. I, I got confused. She looks like the traitor. I didn't know what was going on. Oh, boy. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Man, they're traveling together? That's not good. That's not good. We're getting some good stuff from them, though, so that's good. Oh, man. Um, should I heal? Yeah, I think I shall. Oh, yeah, 15 health for sure. Can I... Yep. Hold down, shift, right click. There you go. I don't know, maybe I shouldn't have used both of them, but... Alright, so that's cool, man. Ooh, two of them. I gotta get better I gotta get better with the bow from a distance. I gotta remember, no arrow drop. No arrow drop. And it doesn't pull to the left. <laughs> it actually goes where you aim. Because I'm telling you, man. I'm telling you guys. The, the, um, the arrows on green hell pull to the left, and the arrows on mist pull to the left as well. The arrows on mist have, have drop and pull to the left. So, when my arrows actually go straight, it just really, really confuses me. But, it's pretty cool though, because if you listen, you can hear them. So, you're not going to like, you know, you're not going to be too, 
too prone to like you know uh, bump into them and have them just gun you down without you knowing. I didn't see her though. I don't know where the hell she came from. How many right, bullets do I have left? Forty-one. Okay, so I'm doing okay on bullets. I'm just not. I'm not good with aiming this gun. I don't know what it is. Something. I feel like it's the mouse sensitivity, but the mouse sensitivity feels really good in every other way. So I don't really want to screw with it. I might though. I might because. Like, it's just, it's so sensitive. Like, you, you just move, like, one tiny centimeter to the left, and the, the freaking crosshairs just go, like, across the screen. Oh, man, I do not feel comfortable, guys. I do not feel comfortable. I am so on edge. Probably more on edge than I should be, to be honest. Um, I messed around with the, um, with the sensitivity a little bit. It just doesn't feel right. I can't get it to feel right. Um, when I turn it down, it feels too low, and then when I, when it's where it is, I, it feels too high. So I turned it down about five points, trying to get it a little bit better. But, alright, so I think this is the last one. I'm going to head home. I think I got 95 now. Nope, 100. Okay. So let's uh, let's go ahead and head home. And you don't want to run too quick because you might run into some bad company. So let's see what we got here. So it looks like we got the, um, the building down here. I'm going to kind of go by the building and see if I looted it all because I don't... I don't think I actually looted all the stuff in some of these buildings. Plus, I'm curious if, if the... If the um, hunters respawn here. Now, the guys I'm fighting now are not the the guards. I think the guys I was fighting earlier that kidnapped the woman and, and I had to kill earlier. I think those were guards. Now, I think I'm dealing with hunters. Because they definitely look different. Okay, yeah, I don't see anything else in here. Yeah, I'm not going to spend too much time in here. I'm pretty, sure I, I'm pretty sure I looted most of this. If not all of it. Okay, let's head on home. Man, I want to pause the video, but I'm afraid. I'm afraid I'm going to get into some action. All right, guys, we're going to have a little bit on this uh, iron. So uh, let's take a look at what we have, and I think I'm going to head back to the trader and do some selling. I want to save enough pistols, um, enough pistol pieces for three. I think that would be pretty cool. Or maybe two. Or three. Yeah. Yeah, well, you know what? We don't have another pistol frame, so let's just sell a couple of these slides. I think that'll be pretty cool. Is there anything else I want to sell? Well, I definitely want to sell this. And I don't really think I want to sell too much more. Um, I do have some arrows being made, but honestly, like, I don't really want to sell them because, like, I don't know. They take time to make. Like, they're not hard to make, but they take time. So, yeah. All right, let's go check. Let's go check out. Well, it's 25 gold to go over there. Maybe I should... All right, we're going to go one more time, but I think I might stop going every day. They, they restock, well, at least last time I played, they would restock every day at, um, at like, 5 p.m. or something like that, or maybe noon. Uh, they would restock. So I'm going to go over there one more time, but I think I might save up till I have some more stuff to sell. I mean, I do have money, so I can always buy stuff. So it's not like I'm really wasting my time here. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and sell this. And this, uh, coal. I thought that was a backpack. I got all excited. Ooh, flashlight. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold your horses. Uh, yeah. Yes, I will buy that flashlight. I think you got a mining helmet. Uh, I'm going to buy the mechanical parts as well. I can make them, but the stuff they take, like, I don't really want to, like, give up. Uh, what else? What else? What else? Cook bacon. Eh. Fish bait. I'm not really doing any fishing right now. Um, I'm going to buy the copper. I'm going to buy the water. And... Uh, let's buy the plastic. Okay. Looks pretty good. I might want to, like, not do all this buying and selling right away because I, there used to be a quest where you had to, like, make, like, a thousand gold or something or spend a thousand gold or something like that. And, like, any time, anything I, if that's, the, if that's the quest, the next quest, anything I buy or sell right now is, like, wasting, like, time. So, but, um, eh, I wanted to go hit the trader. We, we won't hit him again, though, until, uh, until I get some more quests done. Oh, show, I took the wrong one back, man. Look at this. I put down a freaking fairy point right by me, and I'm still not even using it. All right, well, that, that, um, iron should be just about done. Let's go check on it. And I'm hoping it's done. I want to get this uh, boat built. I never built the boat, man. I mean, I guess it's good. I'm going to need fuel for it and stuff. So, man. Damn, this game is good. Freaking golden. Uh, just about there.
All right, guys, I came out here to mine some iron, and I just heard some more voices. Now, I don't know where the heck they came from, so I'm going to kind of give this a wide berth. Try not to talk too much. Hopefully they're alone. And we're just going to kind of come up over here and maybe try and flank them. Be a little quieter in these situations because I need to listen. Hmm, no movement. There he is. Looks like he's alone. See, I'd like to hit him in the head. Ooh. How'd that not hit him? Got him that time. 21 damage. I'm not getting those headshots like I used to. Okay. He's going to come right through here. Hmm. Not seeing him. I'm assuming he's going to run straight for me. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go this way and see if I could flank his last position. See, I don't know I'll if he... kill you. Oh, boy. Okay. Got him there. Got him with the headshot. That's nice. All right, so I just got to do this more often. I'll get better as I, you know, as I kill these guys more often. Use the gun, use the bow. They're very, like, interesting the way they work. He was actually staying around where I was. It looked like he was kind of going back over this way, but as soon as I came back, he was back there. The AI seems um, roughly intelligent. I mean, I mean, not as intelligent as a person, but a person would have just chased me down. But still, they seem to, you know... Okay, guys, finished up gathering iron without further incident. So we've actually got a pretty decent amount of iron. I'm going to set this up to make a couple more iron ingots. I don't want to make too, more, too many at the moment. Uh, let's put that in there. And craft... Nope. Come on, man. Craft. There we go. 259. All right, that sounds pretty good. Um, do I have anything else in here I could do? Why are my mechanical parts in there? I'm not really sure. Oh, by the way, uh, remember how I, how I wanted to make that... Remember how I wanted to make the um, the mining helmet? Well, unfortunately, these aren't mechanical parts. They're electrical parts. So that's going gonna, gonna to take a little bit longer than we wanted to. All right, so let's go ahead and grab the saw bench. And I think we're going to put the saw bench right over here. Number seven, that looks like a pretty decent spot for it. Good a spot as any. Have I ever used the saw bench? I don't remember this last time I played. Chicken, co oh, here we go. Plant bed. Oh, we need fertilizer. Dude, where do you get fertilizer? I haven't gotten any yet. Do we have to craft it? I don't know. We might have to craft it. Um, shipyard, there we go. Oh, wow, that's incredibly easy. I can't believe how easy that is. Um... Pig hut. I, I wonder if the animals reproduce in their in their huts. We got to get some fertilizer though. Um, crafting component used in the crafting in the plant beds. Yeah, but where do I? How do I make it? I don't know. I'm gonna have to look into that. Anyway, um, yeah. Well, let's go ahead and make the shipyard. Okay, so uh, 50, 35, and 50. Oh, actually, that's gonna be a little bit more than I thought. Let's go ahead and turn this off for now, so we don't waste any. Let's see what we got so far. Um, 50. 25 and 50. Nothing in there. Yeah, it's in my building chest, which is this one. Almost. Um, we have more nails somewhere. And we don't have... Oh, right in here. There we go. We got some more nails. There we go. We've got plenty of that. We've got plenty of that. And we do not have anywhere near... Where's all my... Um... Thingamabobs. What are they called? Plant fiber? Yeah, where's all my plant fiber? And I guess I'm going to have to go and get some more plant fiber. Let's see, use that all up. Well, that's easy enough to get. Oh, there's some. Okay, good. So we're halfway there. Okay, guys, just finished the crafting quest. Um, I don't see in the beginning any uh, rewards for these quests anymore. Unless I'm just missing it. Could be. But um, that's a bit of a bummer. So hoping to get some rewards. I like rewards. All right, let's go put this uh, shipbuilding thingamabob down. Um, again, I'm going to put it way over here because I don't want it to get in the way of where I'm going to be building my base. Um, wait, how do we put this down? Do we just click? I'm not getting any kind of ghost image here. Crafting station for boat-related items can only be placed on foundation that is in the water. Oh, interesting. 
Okay. Well, let's make a foundation. It's about done with the foundation. Am I only going to need one foundation? I don't know. Let's take a look. Put this down. Number eight. Now, does that have to be underwater or... Oh, you can't put this stuff underwater, can you? Okay. So it doesn't seem like I can put this underwater. But I do want to rotate it. X. Wasn't X rotate? I thought X was rotate. What the heck? What the ever-loving heck? Rotate. Rotate. Move. Uh, yeah, it's X. I don't know why it's not letting me rotate this. I guess it really doesn't matter, but... Yeah. It's kind of annoying. Don't want it to go a certain way. Alright, whatever, Cage. Does it have to be fully in the water? I think we'll just put it right there just to be sure. Okay. And then we put this bad boy, what, on top of it? Yeah, I guess so. Oh, interesting. Okay. Open shipyard. Alright, we need a fishing boat. Oh, wow. You know what? I could do that today. If we could do it today, we're going to do it today. Uh, teleport or... Click here to relocate your boat or shipyard, especially used for all player death. Click here to relocate your boat to the... Oh, oh, okay. So if you're out in your boat and you die, this will bring your boat back. Okay. All right, guys. We got the boat out. And uh, let's go sailing. Um, it's actually pretty expensive to sail in this thing, by the way. Let me show you around really quick. We got up here we can uh, do some sailing from, which is probably where I'd want to sail from. Uh, we could also come down here. All right. Yeah, looking pretty good. And you come over here. All right, look at this. Look at this. We're going to need a bigger boat. Oh, wow. It's actually got... This is the Jaws boat. This is... I thought it just looked like the Jaws boat. No, this is intentional. This is totally intentional. All right, uh, down here is where you put the fuel and storage. I'll just drop some stuff in here for now. Um, can you use biofuel? I, I don't think you can. Nope. Yep, you just need gas. Now, that's I have enough for nine minutes worth of fuel, and I only have nine uh, gas cans left, which kind of sucks. But let's take a look at where we're looking at, because I'm not really sure. All right, I have a feeling that this... Okay, so I'm, I'm looking north, right? So if I'm looking north, I've got to be on the north end of the island. That's got to be Skull Island. And over there has got to be Betrayal Island. If I go between the two, I can get the Traitor Island, right? Treasure Island. Um... I don't know if wasting the gas to get to Trader Island is worth it. Uh, maybe we should just go check out Skull Island and Betrayal Island. But you know what, guys? I'm sorry, man. We ran out of time. We really did run out of time. This sucks. I really want to use this this uh, freaking boat because it's awesome. All right, guys. If you're enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I will see you next time. And until then, take it easy.